Properties of gases. Kinetic molecular theory explains the properties and behavior of gases. When we say kinetic energy, it means energy due to motion. Gases expand, diffuse, exert pressure, and can be compressed because they are tiny, constantly moving particles and a lot of space between them. According to the kinetic molecular theory, gas particles are in constant straight line motion. They do not interact, they do not attract or repel each other. There is a lot of space between the particles. That's why they can be compressed easily. The average kinetic energy, again, kinetic energy is the energy of motion. And the average kinetic energy of gas particles is proportional to the temperature of the gas in Kelvin which means that as the temperature increases, the particles move faster, therefore have more energy. So because of this, we have the properties of gases. Gases are compressible. Gases assume the shape and volume of the container and gases have low densities in comparison with liquids and solids. Gas particles can exert pressure due to collisions of the particles with the walls of the container. So the factors affecting gas pressure, again, Gas pressure is due to collisions of the particles with the walls of the container. Number one is amount of gas. Increasing the number of gas particles increases the number of collisions. Therefore, the gas pressure increases. The more particles, the greater is the frequency of collisions. And the fewer the number of particles, the lesser is the frequency of collisions. The second factor is the volume. When the volume is decreased, the pressure of the gas is increase. Why? Because the frequency of collision is greater in a smaller volume container. It makes sense than in a larger volume container. Again, the frequency of collision is greater in a smaller volume container than in a larger volume container. Number three is temperature. As the temperature increases, the average kinetic energy, again, kinetic energy is the energy of motion, so the average kinetic energy of the gas increases, collision increases, and therefore the faster moving particles strike the walls of the container with more energy. So as you can see, the three factors affecting gas pressure have something to do with the collision of the particles with the walls of the container. So to conclude, the greater the number of the gas particles, the frequency of collision is 
greater. Therefore, the greater is the pressure exerted by the gas. Volume. When the volume is lowered or decreased, collision is increased. The frequency of collision is greater in the smaller volume. Temperature increases the average kinetic energy. And once the kinetic energy is increased, frequency of collision increases. Therefore, the moving particles strike the walls with more energy. These factors are very important in order to understand the gas laws, which will be our next topic.